So I get asked this question all the time. What's the difference between stainless steel and cast iron cookware? Let's find out. Hi, I'm Jed and this is Cook Culture. So you're probably watching this video because you're interested to know what should you buy, stainless steel or cast iron? So a few things about those two types of cookware, just so that we're all clear on what we're talking about. Cast iron is just that. It's cast iron into a sand mold, finished, polished, however it's done from the factory, you know, pre-seasoned and sent to the store to be sold to you. Stainless steel is the exterior of the pan. The interior of a stainless steel pan is where the work happens. That's going to be aluminum, aluminum alloy. It may have copper in it. Sometimes it has silver in it. Um, they can be of all different sorts of, of qualities and price. You know, same with cast iron. You can get a, a, a varied amount of, of price when it comes to cast iron. And so when you're deciding upon buying cast iron or stainless steel, you're looking for a cookware that's going to match what it is that you're trying to accomplish at home and the type of cooking that you like to do. And that's the, the biggest variable with it. So I'm not gonna show you how any stainless steel or cast iron cooks because there are actually way too many variables to try to show you exactly the difference between them. Right here, I have a Demeyer uh, Pro line, and this is from what they call their Atlantis series. This is a seven layer aluminum, aluminum alloy, stainless steel inside and out pan. It is extraordinarily heavy for a stainless steel pan. And here I have a number 10 field American made cast iron skillet. These pans are not a whole lot different in weight. This is a, a larger pan, of course, so it feels a little bit heavier, but the weight quality of these are very, very, very similar. So what I would say to somebody that's looking for something of a very, very high quality is that there's a smaller amount of difference between the quality of the high end of aluminum core stainless steel cookware to a high end cast iron pan. You start to get so much density and thickness and weight in your stainless steel cookware that it's to mimic the way in which a good cast iron pan is going to work. However, if you're looking for you know, price conscious cookware, cast iron from a performance base is going to do better for you. If you're looking to buy like a piece of lodge, it's hard to find a equivalent stainless steel pan that's going to give you the same quality of results as a lodge pan. So what the variables are then is maintenance. So looking after a lodge pan for say $40 Canadian, uh, comparatively to a $40 stainless steel pan is it's going to take more maintenance and more effort to look after your lodge pan, but the performance is going to be non-comparable between a, a, a cheap stainless steel aluminum based pan compared to your $40 lodge pan. And as you go up in quality, as you start to spend more money, the cast iron pans get better in the way in which they're finished and their design. Uh, and, and their you know, lightness to quality. Uh, Field is, is no, well known for being a, a light to quality cast iron pan. But what happens with stainless is that as they get better and better, they start to behave a little bit more like cast iron. They hold their heat incredibly well and they distribute their heat incredibly well. And so the difference between them narrows. So as you spend more money on cookware, stainless or cast iron, the quality difference on how they cook starts to narrow to a point where these two pans that are two of the best quality pans in the world cook very, very similarly. They do a lot of the same sort of thing. I can season, of course, in my cast iron pan where if I cook at the right temperature in my stainless steel and I use a Liebenfrost effect where I'm finding just the right sweet spot, I can cook with a little bit of oil and things basically become nonstick. Again, very slight differences. So using the cast iron pan being well seasoned, it's more forgiving. You can have it really well seasoned. If it's a little cooler, a little hotter, a little variable in heat, then it seems to allow you to have things that don't stick. If you do that with stainless, things stick. If it's too hot, too cold, 
you have problems. You just gotta find that right temperature. The beauty with high-end stainless steel is the variability is wider. So you have a bigger window of it being more of a, of a perfect temperature within a high-end stainless steel aluminum core pan than you do in a cheap pan. A really thin, cheap aluminum core stainless steel pan, it's kind of sweet spot to cooking is very, very small. So in summary, if you're buying high-end cookware, it doesn't matter as much of what you're looking to buy. The, the, the choice that you're gonna have is, do you like the idea of cast iron? Do you like the, the old school approach to cooking low and slow with cast iron cookware? It, it definitely can brown a little bit better over time. Things cook a little bit more thoroughly uh, in cast iron somewhat when it comes to high-end cookware, not, not a massive difference. Um, we're stainless, uh, it's an easy cleanup. You don't have to worry about seasoning it. Uh, you can use something like Barkeeper's Friend or Bonami or Comet on it to clean it and make it all perfectly shiny if you've got any oil that's built up on it. So if you love perfectly clean cookware and you wanna keep it clean, I would suggest to go with stainless. If you love the idea of using cast iron and the, the heritage that comes with that, then that is more of a choice. And that's, you know, from the, the, the hundreds of pans that I sell every year, that is the choice that people are making. And this may sound silly that I'm not giving you a technical reason of buying this pan over that pan, but people that are really, really happy with their cookware, they buy a pan that they relate to. They see that pan, they're like, yeah, I, I really wanna cook with that pan. Somebody who really wants to keep it super clean and loves high performance, that's perfect. Somebody who's like, hey, I really wanna season it and care for it and look after it and clean it a certain way, have all the tools and do it a certain style. And I wanna take it and put it outside on the campfire once in a while. I wanna take it camping with me. That's the, the, the allure and the love of using cast iron. So I hope that helps somewhat. It's not exact. There's no science to this of choosing exactly the cookware for your type. Uh, I hope that helps. Any questions, please throw them below and I'll get back to you. Thanks so much.